just a quick review of the basics for example string s is equal to the commas anything for example i put anybody can learn python programming but must practice every day then i will go for print s anybody can learn python but must practice every day now i want to check the len so len function print len s so is 64 I change something continuously for example that most practice every day continuously now I want to see the continuously now I will check the lane lane is now 77 now I want to go for indexing as you know first is first element is zero and you must put a one two three four all the way counting the spaces also so for that uh, for indexing I say declare index is equal to minus one for i in s index is equal to index plus one print index uh, one string index then index and for neatness colon and I so I'll go for it. So index zero is A and index one is N and on the way seventh is the space. So here the layer is seventy seven. I make this one. So it is counting all the elements. So last is seventy sixth plus zero adding. So total makes seventy seven. Now slicing. Uh, print s in square bracket uh, anything seven six four five for example control enter let me run can learn python programming but must practice i change it to 37 And learn programming if I change to two. So reversing, if you want to reverse this string, print s in square bracket colon colon minus one. So last one will be taken first. So I run it. Control enter. So this is become reverse way. Anybody can learn python programming like this so for example I, it is like a mirror image so for example i say s yes, the original one comma then i will put one mirror inside say this is mirror and if i print now what it will show like Uh, this is a long sentence so it is not uh, okay for example this one is equal to rajesh Yeah, because here I did not make it string, that's why it is giving error. So this is the string and this is like um, something mirror and this is become a mirror image of that because string reversing. Then uh, we can go for uppercase s dot upper s dot lower s dot title 
first letter is capital uppercase now replace for example i can replace p e by j so let's try it so python become jython okay now finding the vowels e e i o u for that s dot count so let us see so a has come five times e is four times i is three times so five times four times now we'll go for list uh, list is collection of orderly data showed by square bracket so using this function s dot split so this uh, our string will be converted into list okay so let's go for list and check the lane also so anybody can learn python this has become all in a list lane is 11 now like uh, first time we'll do indexing also this is zeroth then one two three all the way so let's say index is equal to anything zero here i say minus one because i want first element to be zero <coughs> For i in l index is equal to index plus one print index <coughs> for neatness colon and i let us see so this is showing this anybody can learn python programming <coughs> excuse me now slicing the list l in the square bracket whatever slicing we want we change it from say four to tenth. Now string by user input input itself is a function in the bracket in a string we can say enter your sentence enter your sentence there is already commas are there so you need not give so anything blah 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 so that is printed so this is input function now list by user input so l is equal to empty list then in how many uh, items you want in the list then i in the range of that many items then append the list l dot append input enter your items so let's try this how many items i say example five enter your items so anything i will say colors red then blue green yellow for example and say purple the list is ready red blue green so this is the way we can do by <coughs> user input take a empty list number of element, uh, elements how many you want then that n convert into integer because that is a string and append use input function give the instruction and print it so every time first it will ask how many elements then that many times it will ask enter the your uh, item in the list now coming to set set is collection of unordered unique items denoted by uh, curly bracket and now for example i come here so list is collection of mutable order data showed by a square bracket dictionary is collection of key and value an order and mutable showed by a curly bracket so it is collection of unique element no duplicate showed by a curly bracket people is connection